just got a really fancy, expensive Starbucks martini. It's Victoria Rose here. How are you? I'm at the world's largest Starbucks. This week, really, all I've been doing is I've moved. And then we had a typhoon. And that's basically what I've been up to. But today, we're gonna go in and explore the world's largest Starbucks. Now, this is the world's largest Starbucks right now. There's another one coming up in Chicago in America um, soon. So I want to jump on this before it's not the world's largest Starbucks anymore. There's four floors, there is a bar, there's a bakery, there's coffee, obviously at Starbucks. I don't even like Starbucks that much, but I thought it was interesting to come to since it's pretty close to where I'm at um, and just kind of explore it and maybe try an exclusive drink. Let's go in and see what this Starbucks looks like. 32,000 square foot, let's go. So this is the outside of the Starbucks building. First you have to go in and get a ticket to wait in a queue until they call your number to be able to go in. There's a waiting line. Fortunately, the day we went in, it wasn't too bad. It was only a 15 minute wait. So I guess this is where the party's at. So this must be the first floor of the Rose Street. Let's just have a little look around. The first floor. The first floor has everything coffee and Starbucks merch related, even leather coffee holders. There's something in the the air. Air. On the first floor, there is a huge coffee machine thing where you can see all the coffee beans come out from. I don't know the technical terms for things, okay? service is super friendly. On the first floor there is also the bakery. When you go up to the second floor there is a ton of cups on the wall and it leads up into the tea floor where you can find all the Tivana tea stuff. Third floor is the bar, and there is also an outside area. We'll come back to the bar and order some sort of cool drink from here a little bit later in the video. Fourth floor is more of a lounge area. They have a little assembly line and also an outside lounge area. Now that we've had a tour of the whole Starbucks, I think it's best that we order an exclusive Starbucks drink that you can only get at this one. Let's, let's ask about I asked the barista if they had any exclusive drinks, and he said yes, and there's two different kinds. These are the exclusives. It's expensive. I also didn't know what to choose, so I just had him choose for me. That's all for now. Did you get the he chose the siphon coffee, which I didn't know what that was, and this is getting fancier by the second. And I can also watch it being done. He found some seats for me to watch front row, how my coffee is going to be made. Yes, I'll pay. I'm going to go pay. Okay, thank you. 
I didn't realize before, but this is a super high-end coffee place. It's not just your normal, typical Starbucks. It's a Starbucks roastery. Uh, I don't know the difference, but it's all it's all pretty fancy. So this is siphoned coffee. I don't know the process, but apparently this is how it's made. It was $11, kind of expensive, but it was almost worth it to just be able to watch it burn and stuff. So it was very interesting. First time for me. Again, this is an exclusive coffee that you can only get at this particular Starbucks. Okay, I'll be honest here. I'll be the first one to be honest. It wasn't that good. <laughs> but I don't ever think Starbucks coffee is that good. I I'm not gonna be negative here. It was cool and all, but um, it's time to move on to the bar and see what they have in store. Can I get that? Huh? I just found extra money in my wallet, so I'm really happy about it. I got a martini for one. So I am alone now. My friend left. So I'm just going to have this craft martini from Starbucks. I spent way too much on this, but I'm, I'm trying to take myself on a date now. So this is the most I've ever spent on uh, an alcoholic beverage or a beverage in general. Come to think of it, it was $20. I really debated it, but I'm like, let's do it for the date. Take myself on a date. I deserve it, right? Now, I was really hoping that this martini I got would be delish because I paid enough for it. Free chocolate, we're off to a good start. This is so fancy. I've literally never had such a fancy drink. This, I don't know what this is. It's chocolate. Really good. If you ever want to spot me, just look for the orange awkward loner girl. I'm gonna be there. A date with myself. So I just spent way too much here. That drink was twenty dollars, and then the coffee was eleven dollars. So that's or ten dollars. So that's like thirty dollars. Two drinks. It's absolutely ridiculous, and I'm really ashamed of myself. But. It was good. Well, the coffee was just okay. I, I'm not some sort of coffee connoisseur, so I don't actually know what coffee's supposed to taste like, but I don't know, I've never liked Starbucks coffee. Like, I don't like it, but it's probably good. It's strong. <laughs> that drink came with a little truffle chocolate, and I think I had a high, maybe a high percentage of alcohol. Don't know much about martinis, but comment below if martinis have high alcohol. I just wanted to show you guys something different and I thought it was really unique that they have a bar here. So I wanted to try a drink, but they're all really pricey, so I had no choice. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, I enjoyed it, it was good, it tasted really good. That is the world's largest Starbucks. It will soon be topped by Chicago, but that's it for now. I'm gonna go ahead and go home now, but before that, I wanted to show you my outfit of the day. Yesterday, there was sun and there was rain. much for coming along with me in the world's largest Starbucks. Uh, come, 
below <laughs> and I will get back and I will reply to you as much as I can. I try to do that. I'll see you next video. Stay extraterrestrial. <laughs> oh fuck. I just banged my chin on. It's gonna be a bruise. Okay. <laughs> Bye. I love you. Have a fantastic day. Don't forget to like and subscribe and leave some comments for me. Dreamy, breezy, we go.